Hey, Dawn Master here. Just a quick uh, Amazon tool haul. Um, got the Tecton and Gear Wrench on Amazon and the DeWalt at the hardware store. Um, this I've been wanting for a while. Lowe's normally has it, but they haven't. So I found it. My buddy actually found it for me, and they're about 60 bucks. Put any 12 or 20 volt battery on it and you can charge your phone or your flashlight. Pretty cool. So, USB power source, DCB090. Anyway. And for gear wrench, we got a adjustable plier rack. It is a 83129. I have the Lyle plier rack I got off the Cornwall truck for 20 bucks, and this was about the same price, but it's adjustable, so you can put wider stuff in it and adjust it as needed. Um, let's take a look. So it looks like. What we got here, very durable, and you can pop these out and adjust them however you want, or they slide actually. So if you have something wide, a wider pair of pliers, you can do that. Pretty cool. Um, gear wrench, and... Uh, this is made in Taiwan, which is better than China in my opinion. So, gear wrench, picture of the pliers. Quick drop-in design, easy access. Store pliers vertically, adjustable fins for various size pliers, keeps toolbox drawers organized, space saving design. So they're about 20 bucks on Amazon for that gear wrench plier rack. So got that. And then this I was really interested in. So I've been on the fence of getting a brass hammer and I found this on Amazon. They have uh, two different sizes. This is the uh, one pound, and I think they had a two pound one. Um, and it was only like $24, I think. Maybe it was less, but Tecton. Pretty good quality. Main China, Michigan Industrial Tools, TectonTools.com. So it's got kind of like a clear coat over it, but these should work. This should work pretty good. Nice handle. Um. pretty durable anyway that's my uh, my little Amazon and hardware store haul featuring Tecton gear wrench and DeWalt also this is a previous haul I got the uh, Lyle power ground outlet for checking power with your test light very very nice unit makes it easy and um, this is a product of I don't know it doesn't say apparently it doesn't say where it's made and then I have the uh, Lyle 55000 magnetic soldering clamp um, very inexpensive and affordable. 
This one doesn't say where it's made either, but. And then I got the Sexton Deutsch Terminal Removal Kit for taking apart Deutsch connectors. A very nice unit to have. On this Mack truck, I got a pocket UV stick light for AC repair. I found this in the uh, clearance bin on the Mack truck. It takes three AAA batteries. Heavy duty molded clip on back. Made in China. I also got on a BOGO deal. This came free with the test lead set. LED circuit tester. Tw 6, 12, and 24 volt. Molded strain relief. Heavy duty coil. Extends up to 12 feet. Pretty nice. Comes in a decent case. Mac tools. You know I love Mac tools. God, I love Mac tools. Snap on makes some good stuff too, and Snap on's ball joint press. It's unbeatable, but. That's the uh, Mac Tools circuit tester. I haven't used it yet. Uh, I normally use my test light, but it's got your uh, ground negative, negative and positive for uh, testing circuits. So, pretty nice unit. Um, more for advanced advanced electrical uh, repair so anyway I uh, hope you guys like this little quick small tool haul with little units and um, hope you guys have a good night and uh, we'll see you on the next one